What's up guys, it's your boy Demon, and welcome back to another Epic 7 video. It's Monday, patch prediction day. So today we're going to be talking about some of the content, uh, A, that we know for sure is coming, and B, stuff that, you know, I think is going to come over the course of the next couple of weeks. Uh, although, since obviously we do patch prediction every week, we're not going to go too much into detail uh, with the stuff that's coming in the future weeks. Try to focus more so on this week to kind of let you guys know. As you guys know, Cerise has kind of been a thing. If you guys are wondering why my screen, screen orientation is kind of crazy right now, it's because I'm, I'm trying I'm trying to st <laughs> uh, mirror my tablet today, so it's a little bit weird. Uh, we got like some like embroidery on to, on the top and the bottom, but it's all good. So right now, uh, trying to get some more bookmarks. If you guys out there were wondering, like, yo D, where the hell is the Cerise video at? Technically, I have to pull her uh, before I'm able to do a video. So still trying to get Cerise. Uh, once we get her, uh, we'll definitely fill her out so you guys can see her. Uh, might be sooner or later, <laughs> but obviously I got one week left to pull her. So we'll continue to go from there. But in terms of getting into actual content, the first and foremost thing that I want to bring up that we already know uh, most likely is going to be coming this week is new exclusive equipment. Now, granted, this is the exclusive equipment that dropped on February 4th, as you guys can see. But as you guys know, they typically drop exclusive equipment about once every month. So if you guys rewind back to February 4th here, you know, we just count the weeks down. One, two, three, fourth week here, right? Exactly a month. Uh, we could probably anticipate exclusive equipment this week. As to how many or who it's going to be, we have no idea. But chances are they will probably tease this on Facebook probably tomorrow or the next day so you guys can be ready for that now hopefully this is dick pavel <laughs> but we're gonna have to see wait and see who's gonna get some exclusive equipment uh especially because there's a bunch of other heroes that are you know coming you know over the course of time right we got kyle rick on the way we got ml charlotte on the way uh with that we got cerise everybody's still you know kind of you know in the middle of the road about Plus, we got some other crazy content coming potentially this week as well. Now, as we go into the breakdown, shout out to Matt for putting this page together. Uh, he's basically compiled the list of all the likely stuff, and we'll kind of use this as a tool to help you guys kind of guide you along the bullet points as we kind of go through this. Now, also some new things here is uh, New Abyss levels 91 to 100. So if you guys are looking to get your PvP or excuse me, your PvE fix on, uh, you guys will have your hands full as we showcased in the video that we covered for the KR stream a couple weeks ago. Uh, that ridiculous floor with Deanne and Charles and yeah, it was it was just nuts. Again, I'm betting on the fact that Strays is probably the boss for floor 100 and I hope that's definitely the case. Uh, but that's something that you guys can look forward to. Also likely is a new adventure chapter chapter opening, either chapter 9 or 6S or 7S because of the four-week release pattern with the new uh, chapters coming. So that's likely, uh, although not guaranteed. And then, of course, as I mentioned before, uh, the exclusive equipment's guaranteed pretty much will be here this week. Now, in terms of everything else, uh, we just got to finish up the event. Uh, we'll probably get the showcase again for Charlotte, like I told you this week, because we're... Uh, every two weeks because before we relied on the data mines uh but now they finally picked up on it and they're starting to tease the heroes ahead of time so again if you guys haven't checked out tenha um tenha translates the streams if you guys are up at you know 2 a.m 3 a.m pst uh you guys can watch those because the, they'll do a kst or a korean time showcase uh where they showcase the heroes they'll talk about emma charlotte's abilities uh they'll probably showcase kyrick as well so we'll get to see that. And again, if you guys are not awake for those things, I'll definitely be up. So I will format the videos and I'll get that over to you guys so you guys can see that when you guys, whenever you guys wake up in the morning on your way to work or however you guys, uh, you know, consume the content. So anyway, guys, uh, in terms of future, obviously the question is whether Kyle Rick is coming and obviously uh, ML Shaw is going to be here in a couple of weeks and then the new season for arena is going to be starting here soon. So what I recommend that you guys do with all these, you know, all the stuff coming this month, like I said, now is the time to save. So if you guys haven't been saving or if you guys haven't been farming, now is the time to really get yourselves into, you know, your favorite floor 11. Make sure you guys start stacking aside your bookmarks. Make sure you're getting your stuff ready to go um, so you can be ready for Kyle Rick 
even if he's just a four star because I know a lot of you guys want to get him. Hopefully he's a connection hero, then everybody will be able to get him. But if not, if he happens to be a five star and they decide to do an official banner for him, uh, that way you're stacked ready to go or at least have a foot in the door so you'll be more ready. Now, granted, Calric most likely will not be limited since Cerise was limited and I doubt that they'll stack two limiteds together, right? Um, unless obviously it's Guilty Gear again. But with that, you know, he'll be in the game. So if you're not able to like rush and get him right away, it's kind of no big deal. However, uh, with the Mystic Bookmarks, I know you guys want to have first dibs on ML Charlotte. And since we're going to be finding out her skills this week anyway, I would advise that if you guys are close to pity, you guys have been trying to wait to, you know, see what happens before you guys went all in. Now is the time to wait, catch the live stream, or, you know, catch the video that I put out in the morning uh, where I give my take on ML Charlotte and I'll let you guys know, like, what the business is. Now, <laughs> since since Smilegate Super Creative is now in the business of nerfing heroes uh, a day before release, I advise that you just be a little patient and see what happens <laughs> before ML Charlotte comes out. And so that way, you know, you know, yeah, I'll try to t tone the hype meter down a little bit, too, just in case now that I know that they like to just nerf heroes, you know, two to two minutes before they before it gets released. Uh, so that way it's safe sailing. Uh, with that being said, guys, um, that's pretty much all that's coming for patch prediction this week. Like I told you guys, uh, they set the precedence with all the other content that's going to be coming and i told you guys before that now it's just literally going to be a bunch of heroes i'd imagine over the next few months plus like little side story stuff and pve fill-in content uh before the next major major release which is probably going to be episode three and or another collab so if they decide to redo guilty gear collab i'd imagine that'll happen sometime soon soon is relative of course probably within the next two to four months However, if they don't decide to do it, then Guilty Gear will probably come back uh, sometime after Episode 3 launches, which, if that's the case, it won't be for a while, because they still gotta finish up, we still gotta kick Stray's ass, and then after that, then they gotta transition us into Episode 3, tell us what's coming for Episode 3, you know, all that jazz was just gonna be a whole slew of content. So... Anyway, guys, um, that's all I wanted to cover today. Uh, just a few basics again. Shouts out to Math for just really compiling all the information, making it simple. Um, because now I can give you guys bullet points and be like, look, this and this and this and this is coming. You guys can see it on paper. And then I'll also talk about some things that I speculate that would be coming, obviously, along the way. So in the comment box, guys, let me know what you guys think. What are you guys most hyped about? Are you guys actually hyped for ML Charlotte? Are you guys hyped for 91 to 100 in Abyss? Are you guys hyped for... For JP voices that should be coming sometime this month. Let me know that in the comment box below. But anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, it's your boy Damone, and we will see you guys in the next video. Peace.